Facebook shares jumping sharply in yesterday's trading, pushing the market cap into the four comma club. Also yesterday, federal court dismissing two court cases against the social media giant. Rich Greenfield is here, co-founder and partner at Lightshed Partners. We're going to get to the big NFL media news in just a moment, but want to dig into the Facebook news. You've read through the court's uh, decision. Do you think the FTC refiles, Rich, and what happens next? Look, I think, you know, you've seen governments all around the world and regulatory bodies all around the world trying to figure out what to do with these massive tech giants that really are just continuing to grow at an unprecedented rate. You know, I think the fear is, is just that these companies are getting too big. That being said, it's hard to see from a consumer standpoint. Consumers love using these platforms and keep spending more and more time on these platforms. And to be fair, Andrew, I think the hardest thing is, is even if you broke them up, like, what is that actually achieving? Like, even Instagram or, you know, a lot of these things as separate entities would be massive companies with massive power. So, I, I again, not really sure how you do it. And I'm not sure it actually is in consumers' best interest if they're broken up, given sort of the value and um, how they actually make consumers' lives easier and better. I think that's really the challenge. And you think a judge is effectively going to be in your camp, not just the judge that, that made this ruling yesterday, but you think long term, as this sorts its way through the courts, there will not be a breakup in the end? Well, I, I would actually, that's, I think, the key word. As it works its way through, I mean, do you remember how long it took the Microsoft case? I mean, this is probably not going to be decided under the at least the first Biden administration. I can't predict whether there'll be a second but this is probably not something that gets decided over the next several years, right? This is probably going to take years upon years, if not a decade, as every, you know, different bodies take different views. Who knows what regulatory? And again, that is, leaves aside the fact that think about Europe. In Europe, they may just make regulations. Like, so we have no idea how this sort of plays out. You see a lot of, you see a lot of attacks on all of these big tech companies. Facebook's not alone. I think everyone's right. trying to figure out how do you actually do this? without, you know, without actually screwing up how these companies actually, you know, operate on a day to day basis. They're so integrated. It's just not so easy to say, hey, split them up, make them smaller. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.